This is TFC HQ presented by Kia and I am Gareth Wheeler. Toronto FC back at home Wednesday night taking on the Philadelphia Union and a chance for a piece of history. They could equal a club record for points in a season with 53 points and that's still with eight games remaining if they come away with the full three points on Wednesday. TFC currently sitting on 50 points after delivering Chicago Fire their first home loss of the season in a 3-1 victory on Saturday night. And there were three, as in there are just three teams in MLS at present time that are still undefeated at home. Toronto FC is one of them, nine wins and three draws on the season. BMO Field has become a true fo a fortress for TFC, and the captain, Michael Bradley, understands how important home field really is. Um, we're, we're so lucky that, that that we get to we get to play our home games there. You know, it's it's our it's our home. It's where it's where our fans are. It's where our, we we every single time walk out onto the field and have uh, un unbelievable support. Congrats goes out to Toronto FC midfielder Murky Delgado. Back to back weeks with goals. Back to back weeks. He's featured in the MLS Team of the Week. He scored the first goal in Chicago over the week and some overall solid play as well. Sees him in the top 11 in MLS yet again. Toronto FC looking forward to being back at home. They haven't lost a regular season game at BMO Field in 13 games consecutively. And TFC overall haven't lost since July 1st. Home away undefeated in seven but really it isn't the regular season which has been a true marker for Toronto FC in what's been an incredible run over recent months it really started off last fall in TFC's first playoff game against Philadelphia against the Union it was the first win in club history in the postseason and that has really turned into a whole lot of good for Toronto FC since that time here is head coach Greg Van any. Uh, it was an important game for us and and you know getting the win I thought really was our the catalyst for us going on a great run thereafter and so um, you know obviously that was last year this is this year we're in a different position right now and they're in a different position. No new injuries for Toronto FC which is good news heading into a busy week Wednesday at home against Philadelphia Sunday it's rivalry week in MLS taking on the Montreal impact. Something else to look out for on Wednesday night. The last time that Philadelphia and Toronto FC played, it was the second game of the season, a 2-2 draw on a frigid day in Chester, Pennsylvania. Alejandro Bedoya, a U.S. men's national team teammate of Josie Altidore, hit out, out at him afterwards saying that he goes down lightly sometimes. That didn't sit well with Altidore. And although these two players have been in U.S. men's national team camp together since and they're friends off the field, it'll be interesting to see if Josie Altidore plays with a little bit more edge, understanding what Bedoya said about him last time out. It adds a little extra spice into what should be an exciting night down at BMO Field. Hope to see you there. It's an 8 p.m. kickoff down at BMO. You can watch on TSN 1345. Listen on TSN 1050.